I, I listen uh, to like the sure. whole conversation of like what evil is, and uh, we can talk about how people do vile things and how they uh, commit crimes, such as killing people and uh, uh, psychopaths, for the matter. But I think it goes beyond that. I think it goes farther. So I, I wrote my notes here. I want to go back to true evil. It's an intriguing subject because it's all around us. By the way we live and how the world works the way it does. There is a quote I've always liked. The devil is but one man, but true evil is a collaboration of men who wears $3,000 suits. Now we can talk about psychopaths who kill people later on and get caught. But I personally believe true evil is when you are in a position of power, who has no morals or values, who are dishonest, and lie to the public in the name of policy, who rage war for profit, who keep the people oppressed and keep them there so they don't have a free mind or free will, who makes people believe nothing is possible when in reality it is possible. Life is normalized, so people think that it's normal when in reality we can make a change and live better. Now, with that being said, there are different types of evil and reasons for why people do the things that they do. But what's common is where it comes from. Who causes it? Why people do the things that they do? Now, we can talk about psychopaths, but we'll leave that out of it because we're mentally messed up. But, um... I don't see how many of my notes. Oh, actually, I didn't know my notes. I'm a little buzzed. <laughs> Sorry, I'm a little buzzed right now, but. Uh... We're, we are too, but we're following. Keep going. This is amazing. Keep going. Keep going. We are people that act on bad influences for many reasons. People act out because of the environment the way they live, where they grew up, a place that isn't livable. We can talk about how religion can regularize people, such as uh, the Middle East. But real evil are the people who change people, who profit off of the public and give them a false sense of freedom. Mm, yeah. um, uh, shit, I'm like that's where I stopped. Like I, yeah. I Dude, literally. You, you covered so much. Uh, that was amazing. I, honestly, I think I did a pretty good job being buzz, but you know. Really, really. <laughs> but um, no. He couldn't just, tell until you told us. He just said no. Yeah. Nobody knows. Yeah, but um, I don't know. It's something. But that, seriously, how many of you feel that? Like, how many of you feel resonated with that? Like, come on, my like, God, it's amazing. Let's yeah. hear. I want to hear loud. Like, yeah. Yep, yep, I'll uh, go uh, back what, what is your name? Uh, Daniel. Daniel. Pleasure. I'm Tiffany. Uh, What's your last name? Uh, Daniel Fernandez Espinosa. Daniel Fernandez Espinosa, my friends. Woo! This man's a poet. We're going to see him on the stage doing something like, uh, you do a little bit of No, no, I, I usually do comedy, but uh, it's... Oh, uh, that wasn't I, funny at all. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I only do comedy like three times. But we all know the best comedy comes from the heart and that shit was real as fuck. 